I'm Thomas Lehman, Chief of the Division of Pediatric Rheumatology here at the Hospital for Special Surgery. Did you know that children, just like adults, can get scleroderma? Many people don't realize that children are subject to this disease just as adults are. Scleroderma can cause hardening of the skin, difficulties with the heart, the lungs, the kidneys, and many other problems which can be life-threatening. Early diagnosis is an important part of the proper care of both children and adults with scleroderma. Often the first sign of scleroderma in a child is when they develop Raynaud's phenomena, cold hands which turn colors when they get exposed to something like opening the icebox or going outside in the snow. The hands will turn red, white, and blue, and this is called Raynaud's phenomenon. Raynaud's phenomenon is common in many children and is often not a sign of scleroderma. But if a child with Raynaud's phenomenon begins to develop sores on their fingers or other problems or skin lesions, it's important they be seen by a pediatric rheumatologist and properly evaluated to make sure it's not a more significant illness. Here at the Hospital for Special Surgery, we have a team of five pediatric rheumatologists dedicated to the care of children with rheumatic diseases, and we're experts in the care of scleroderma. Thank you.